today i am wrapping the buick which may not sound like a lot anyone who doesn't know me doesn't know that i've been driving around a car that is multiple colors for over a year now and it's been a spectacle to say the least it's been an eyesore for the whole tampa community we might be able to see it actually that's my vehicle on the other side's pink but this side's been red for its entire life there is really no excuse for my slacking other in the sense that I didn't want to do it because it takes so much work. Today I'll go to the shop and do it. The mirrors are gonna be that. So this is what's on my car normally. This isn't even technically car wrap, but I don't really care. It'll be fine. It'll probably just like last six months. I guess let, let's go to the shop. If I don't look so good, it's because I am not good. I literally threw up. I literally threw up in the shop toilet. But I got the fender done. Wanna fucking know what I ended up doing today? I look like this because guess what happened? I had a problem with the wrap on my rear door on the driver's side. What had happened was the wrap popped out from where the little door cup is, where you grab the handle of the car. And um, I needed to obviously redo the door cup. And when I did this, I fucked up and I unscrewed the little T25 that is fucking on the inside of the door and I dropped the screw into the door panel so then I had to rip apart my entire rear door panel and then find the screw, which I didn't even end up finding. My fucking boss ended up finding it for me, thank God. Then if that wasn't enough, I had already taken the entire door apart to find this fucking screw and I was leaning it against the car because I'm fucking stupid and I don't think about anything before I do it. And I must have leaned against it or something because I literally ripped the wrap on the quarter panel. Now, the reason why this is so bad is because the quarter panel takes me like five hours to do on my own. And I was like, fuck. That's a big fucking piece of wrap. That's a lot of money right there that I just ruined. And at the same time, I also destroyed my door wrap. Because guess what? In my little door handle, there was water. And we heated the vinyl not knowing there was water under it. So it did something I'd never fucking seen before. In all my like eight or nine months of wrapping, it literally boiled underneath the wrap and then bubbled up and ripped a hole in it, like a little bubble. And it's so weird. And yeah, now my fucking door is fucked up and my fucking rear quarter panel's fucked up and my trunk is also fucked up and literally every single panel on my car needs to be redone essentially. There's not one perfect panel that is wrapped on my car. It's crazy, right? Because I literally do it for a living the film the film is so fucky i really needed better quality film at the same time i also wanted to experiment today because i thought it would work even though it didn't fucking work when i used craft vinyl to wrap my mirror i used craft vinyl to wrap my mirror and it just didn't have an air release Oh, what the fuck? I don't have a fucking air release in my fucking vinyl wrap. <sighs> so, it literally looks like a...
plastic screen protector that a seven year old put on an iPad very poorly and it's wrinkled and it just looks like ass. It's actually very embarrassing to have on my mirror right now, but I don't really give a fuck. I just drove home with the fucking magnet on my car from the shop. I wish I was joking. Today was not playing with me. Today kept me in check. I threw up at work. I felt like a little kid in the shop. Hey, Sean, I threw up. Get the fuck out of here. At the same time, nothing I can't redo. Nothing I can't handle. Pain is only in my heart, not in my soul. I just said to Hannah, once that car is one color and the mirrors are holographic rainbow and everything looks good on it, the entire fucking city of Tampa is gonna be like, oh, bejesus, oh, thank lord, because everyone will have been waiting for that shit. And my vehicle has been such an eyesore to the community for over a year now. I'm hoping I can do the side tomorrow. That'll be that, but this is it for now. I look like shit. I feel like shit. So yeah, I successfully fixed some parts that were fucked up. But as you can tell, that's where my little bubble came in. And that is where I fucked up the door panel. And that piece is a very very big um so it's great i'm gonna have to redo that along with the trunk which is fucked up my boss keeps joking telling me this looks like a thong i get it but it doesn't make it okay oh how could i forget the mirrors look how bad they are that it's like record bad from a distance all right but God damn, that shit is fucked. It's straight embarrassing. There's no air release. And that's why I gave up on it. Wow, it's beautiful. It's the next day and I did the two other doors on the other side and found the film that I will be doing the mirrors in, which will be in a video which I'll link once I do, eventually. But as of right, whoa, this shit's going like, 30 FPS and a 60. That's pretty cursed. Anyways, yeah, that's it.